The old city hall in Tampa turns 100 years old this year, but the historic landmark is threatening to become a safety hazard at the same time. ABC Action News reporter Adam Weiner is there now. He's live. And Adam, what, if anything, is going to be done to try and save this building? Well, right now, city workers tell us that they are planning fixes to try to prevent this building from becoming a danger to the public. Because this is what happens after 100 years. There's parts of the outside of the building that are falling apart. And there's likely many problems inside the walls of the building, like leaks and water intrusion that the city says they likely haven't even found yet. I took a tour of the building recently, and parts of the building are literally crumbling. So city council is now planning to spend about $16 million over the next few years to give this building a major makeover, especially on the building exterior where we saw portions of terracotta coming apart and coming off. We saw the differences with something like this with a fracture or hairline crack. Yeah. We can actually repair those okay. by making a repair, glazing and firing. Okay. But with something with like the one that you see in front of you that's held together with the zip tie, these would actually have to be replaced. Now, because of historical guidelines, the renovation is going to be a tedious and expensive task. But of course, the building houses the city council. So the city council telling us, of course, that they believe this historical landmark simply too important to let it just crumble away. For now, live in Tampa, Adam Weiner, ABC Action News.